Hello everybody and welcome back to Uncharted 2 Honor, is it Honor Among Thieves or Among Thieves? Oh, I can't remember, I am literally recording this right after the first episode um, So we've, we've been double crossed by Flynn Because, you know why not? Here it is. I also left the detonator for you. And we're arming and detonating bombs. Trying to sneak into a camp. Alright. First one set. Don't touch the button. This one? <laughs> I mean I'd press it. Once you've set all the charges, just hit the detonator and it's showtime. <laughs> They'll never know what hit them. Just be careful. Zarovich has got his men posted all around the perimeter. That's great. Still looking for treasures whilst we're playing. There's one right there. That I don't know if I can... Is that a treasure or is that just a bug? How does one get that? Okay, let us just carry on. It's right there. That's gonna really annoy me that I can't get that. Keep an eye out for patrols. Sweating like a hooker in church. You brought a hooker to church? Why not? No, oh, fair enough. Don't let him spot you. Let's take these guys out. I don't even see him. Okay, well you should be dead. Damn, I'm a good shot. Fuck off, you can get me from there. You buddy, looking at me. Looks like we can swing across there. Okay. You can. All right, hold on, Grandpa. See if I can find another way up. Sweet. Oh, an AK. Oh, a piece of candy. Okay, you just casually push that out of the way. Thanks, kid. This way. Nate, you should be approaching excavation site one by now. They should have been back by now. Shit, we've been spotted. Take them out. Yeah, not really, not really much I could have done about that one.
should be getting close to the first camp. I've planted four more charges in there, but you're going to have to clear the place out before you can arm them. Okay. I don't know why I jumped over there. What is the point of this? Where the hell does this go? To a shiny. Is this a thing? I don't think there was any point in that. Here's the camp. You ready for this? Let's do it. What else does he expect to find? Don't let Lazarevich hear you talking like that. Okie dokie. Oh, for fuck's sake. Okay, nothing there. Get all of the ammo. Why are you... Three of the charges. There should be only two left. All right, one more, and we're out of here. There it is. Okay, that's all of them. Now let's go pay Mr. Lazar a visit. Here, 
it reaches. Come on over here, I'll give you a boost. All right. Come on, gorgeous, jump up. Yeah. Uh, you got a great ass, Sully. <laughs> All right. Ooh, that must have been some tsunami to wash these ships so far inland. Treasures. Really? None? Okay. Surprised about that. Get down. The pop is down again. Uh, the damn thing is always breaking down. Come on, let's just fix it so we can get out of here. Look, they're not armed. Well, not that many. What are we waiting for? We can take these guys. I don't know, Sully. Maybe. Stop right there! Bitch your ass, bitch. Bitch your ass. Frivolity mean? What do you bet we follow the hose? We find the camp. You always follow the hose. Just like in Montreal, huh? You're never gonna forget that, are you? I see the camp up ahead. Three months and you have found nothing. Well, well, well now wait, wait a minute. We've been commander. It must be Lazarevich. This man was caught stealing artifacts from site number five. for this? No, no, Zoran, I can't explain. No, no, need, no need. <laughs> All yours, kid. I'll cover you from here. <laughs> Some fool left a sniper rifle up here. Careful, Nate. Looks like they left a couple of sentries behind. Okay, okay kid. It's showtime. I've already had an AK. Got a 
sleep. Yes. Okay. Man, this Lazarevich guy isn't screwing around, Sully. You should see all this stuff. He's got files on every expedition to find Shambhala. All the way back to the 1600s. What about Marco Polo's journals? <laughs> yeah, they are. Just hurry it up. You haven't got much time. Worthy pilgrim is granted a golden passport to conquer obstacles on his journey to Shambhala. Huh. Is that supposed to mean something? Beats me. Hold on. Here we go. It was with great sorrow that I left my fellow travelers to their fate. A fate decreed by the dreadful cargo we bore from Shambhala. They must have thought that tsunami was some kind of divine retribution. Wait a minute. Sully, I don't think the Chintamani stone is here. What? Listen to this. I, I would have sooner endured the wrath of Kublai Khan himself than remove the Chintamani stone from that sacred shrine. Marco Polo never had the stone. Then what dreadful cargo was he talking about? I don't know. Well, if the stone's not here, what the hell is Lazarovich looking for? Shambhala. Here in Borneo? He's a little wide of the mark, don't you think? He must be trying to pick up Marco Polo's trail back to Shambhala. Why? <laughs> because the stone is still there. <sighs> Chloe, can you talk? Hold on. Yeah, I'm here. In all this digging they've done, have they found any bodies, any remains at all? No, now that you mention it, nothing. Why? <laughs> Over 600 people were shipwrecked here, yet there's no bodies. Don't you find that a little odd? So where did they all go? Where would you go if a tsunami hit? Bingo. We head to that mountain. What do you bet we find Marco's pals? Chloe, can you meet up with us? Already on my way. Great. Uh-oh. Nate, you gotta get out of there. You're gonna have to give me a minute, Sully. You don't have a minute. What's this? They're all dead. Oh, crap. Right up. Stay down, kid. I got you covered. Nate. Well, that's convenient. Very convenient. Beat your ass. Can you get in the cover, please? No? Maybe? Thank you.
I don't even know which way I'm supposed to be going. I don't know where I'm supposed to be going. Reinforcements. Okay. Move in the house, please. Thank you very much. I don't know how I'm supposed to. Should be this way. Okay, now where are we off to? Sully, look at these stones. Ah, now we're getting somewhere. What a view. <laughs> Would you look at that? Oh, yeah. Hey. Hello. What do we have here? With any luck, it's the last resting place of Marco Polo's crew. Shall we check it out? Yes, I think we do. Wow, this place must be thousands of years old, at least. Down this way. Looks like we hit the jackpot. Ugh, must be hundreds of bodies down here. Look at their teeth. They're all black. Looks like they're all that way. They must have taken refuge here during the tsunami. There's got to be some sort of clue around here.
Hmm. I am looking for secrets. Oh my god. Batman. Hey, I think I found something. In here. What? They must have carried yeah, that's their cargo secret. all the way up here after they were shipwrecked. Really? All these open spaces and no secrets? I've seen this before. Sully, give me a light. Oh. Wait a minute. This is blood. It's everywhere. Looks like a real massacre. All right, let's follow the blood stains. We'll see if they lead somewhere. Yes, because that's always a good idea. Bloodstains, follow the bloodstains. Seems to end at this wall. Yeah, that's odd. This moves a little. Sully, help me out. The trail leads in here. Hey, look at that, more blood. God. You know, maybe I'm crazy, but it looks like they all killed each other. Come on, mate. You're just getting spooked. Wow. Look at this. What do we have here? Nate, you're gonna give me a goddamn heart attack. Oh. Man, is that an ugly friggin' thing? What is it? Some kind of weapon? No, no, it's a, a perba. It's a ritual object from Tibet. It's used to destroy obstacles. Huh? No, you know, spiritual ones. Oh. Wait a minute. Wait, could this be what Marco Polo was talking about? Kid, I don't even know what the hell you're talking about. In his journal, he wrote that uh, the worthy seeker would be given a golden passport to conquer obstacles on the journey to Shambhala. So, what, this is it? Look, that's all really interesting, but where the hell is it a passport to? Well, maybe this map would help. Let me see that. <laughs> Between Greater India and the province of Tibet, lies a field of exquisitely finished temples. Hundreds of gilded spires stretching as far as the eye can see. Hold on, I know this place. It's in Nepal. Yeah, except it's not just a field of temples anymore. It's a city. Well, that could make things a little more challenging. Now, hold on, there's more. In all these many temples, only one conceals the secret path to Shambhala. And that path shall only be revealed to the pilgrim Bears the golden passport. Oh, <laughs> right. Nice work, kid. So, what are we waiting for? <laughs> Let's get out of here. All right. See ya. Let's get going. I'm going to look for some secrets. This room. The room I was just in. 
I'm gonna go out and make sure the coast is clear. I'll see you in a bit. Should have known it was you. <laughs> and you, Victor Goddamn Sullivan. You still dragging this tired old sack of shit around? Easy, Nate. That's pretty ballsy for a guy who spent the last three months behind bars. Better than pissing away three months in the jungle without a clue. Found the ships, though, didn't I? You couldn't find your own ass with both hands. And a map. They came from down there. Whoa. Harry, look at this. Speaking of maps... Between India and Tibet... One temple will reveal a pathway path to Shambhala. Jesus, Flynn, while we're young. Oh, no. Don't be such a bad sport. Take them to Lazarevich. You're gonna wish you'd stayed in prison, mate. Move. Keep moving! Ah, oh, shit! Are you all right? Yeah, well, it'll make it look more believable. Now I'm gonna try and buy you some time. No, Chloe, you have to come with us. No. Just meet me in Nepal. Now run. Let's go. I like her. Yeah, I bet you do. All right, we're running. Shit! They've spotted us. Run for it! Now, time for you. Thanks for the heads up. You're welcome. Just going around. How about you shoot back? Jump? Oh, hold on there, son bitch. You gotta be out of your mind. We'll break our goddamn necks. If we get caught, Lazarevich will break them for us. I'm getting too old for this bullshit. Oh, come on, now don't you start this again. Listen, I don't have your luck. Guys like me gotta know when to walk away from the table. Sully, we're gonna get out of this, okay? We always do. Yeah. You go meet your girl in Nepal. I'm going somewhere warm. Come on. Hey, you can tell me all about it when you get back. There they are! Oh, shit. Well, shall we? After you, Butch. See you in hell, kid. <laughs> shit. Well, when you said Lazarevich had a head start on us, you weren't kidding. Well, he's had some help from the local guerrillas. The city's been on the brink of civil war for years. He just needed to throw a little gasoline on the fire. Charming. Yeah, well, all the chaos provides some cover while he destroys the city looking for the right temple. Nate? Hello? Yeah, I'm still here. You're not having second thoughts, are you? Oh, me? Never. Good, because I'm so ready to be done with these clowns. You got a map? Uh... Yeah. I'll meet you in the old market. Things are pretty quiet over there. All right, you got it. Uh oh. I got company. Oh, great. Can you lose them? I think it might be too late for that. Come on. Nate, are you all right? I've been better.
Okay, we're running again. Don't they ever give up? Ah! This one here. Hope you enjoyed. And um, goodbye, peoples and persons. Goodbye.